what's going on? It has been way too long um, since I posted a video. And a lot of that has to do with just me becoming a complete zombie. Um, my last two videos was honestly like my first couple of weeks on overnights at Lowe's. Thought I was going to get a lot of time to do YouTube, but that kind of turned against me. And I had no time to do anything because I had no motivation, no energy, no nothing. I would work Sunday night, Tuesday night, when Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday nights. And then I'll be off Thursday, Friday, Saturday. I sleep all Thursday, still be tired Friday. And then Saturday, I would get all my stuff done around the house. I will try to get a little bit of coding done if I wasn't too tired still. And then Sunday, it was get up, go to the gym, and then back to work that night, rinse and repeat. Um, that was from November till about this past week because my Lowe's career has officially ended. Um, Almost there for four years. It would have been four years, uh, June 3rd of this year. Um, I started there in June of 2017. Right after college, I graduated. I think the date was May 17th of 2017. Um, maybe not. Maybe like May. I don't know. Sometime in May of 2017, I graduated college. And about three weeks later, I started working at Lowe's as a part-time appliance associate. You know, working 20 hours a week on the weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, wasn't what I thought I was going to be doing after college, you know, after getting a degree in a, a bachelor's ar bachelor of arts degree in digital design. And then I ended up at Lowe's. But, you know, shortly after I worked part time, I actually got a promotion to a sales specialist spot within a few months. And then um, after learning sales skills and just different skills, I kind of uh, had the opportunity to become a service manager there, which then let me control four departments or so and I was opening and closing the building and I was doing um a lot more stuff on the leadership team and about a year later the organization did a completely switch to the manager team and we all went to supervisors which had me control less of an area um I ended up when I was service manager I was doing like the lumber area the lumber the tools hardware and then once we switched I went back to appliances and I oversaw cabinets, appliances, and then millwork, which is like your doors and your windows. And then um, I did that until November of 2020. And that is when I went overnight. And I kind of did overnight just to get, you know, a different... Kitty cat, uh, we're recording the video, relax. So we went to overnight in November just to give myself more time. The stress was killing me. Um, the stress was so bad that I was just like, I literally can't deal with the customers right now because it was like, go to work and just get your life torn apart. So I was like, I can't really do that much more. Um, but good news this past couple weeks ago, I woke up with an, um, offer letter in my email from a company that I will be a UI developer, user interface developer, um, contractor for this company so this is step one a new chapter of me and my programming journey and i'm not going to get too into this because i'm going to save this for the next video or two videos from now um i didn't go to school for programming i did not go to school for web development i had no idea what code even was but december of 2018 19, one of those two, I want to say 18, um, is when I started learning my uh, coding, or is when I started my learn to code journey, and boy, oh boy, that is where my life took off, but I explained that in some other videos, and I'll go more in depth into that, so once again, I did not go to college for coding, I had no idea how to write a single line of code until after graduating college, but um, yes, my low square is done, I no longer work there. I actually, this past week, I put in about 20 hours to my new job, which I'll be working um, remote because obviously COVID and can't exactly go into um, offices right now. Well, you, some states you can, but my position is currently completely remote, which is kind of insane. I literally have no idea what my life is going to turn into shortly because literally the person I am today from the person I was in college, post-college, like right after college when I started, it was completely 
two completely different people. So we'll see what happens. Um, I'm super excited. But in the meantime, I recorded a clip of myself putting my two weeks in, which is the same exact day I got that offer. So let's cut back to that and check that clip out. All right, guys, present Brandon here. Um, I'm out front of Lowe's. Um, there you go, Lowe's, which is uh, where I've been working for the last three and a half years. And today is a special one. I'm officially putting my uh, two weeks in. Um, it's been a crazy long journey, but I am uh, moving up in the world, you could say. And this is, uh, I just wanted to record this clip. I haven't been on YouTube and I don't even know how long, but I know I shouldn't have waited for this moment to come back, but this, the overnight job actually got crazy. It completely deteriorated me. And um, driving to work tonight, I actually didn't stress out driving to work, which honestly sounds very unhealthy, but it's kind of what I've been dealing with. So um, this is it. In two weeks, I will officially be done with Lowe's. I'm getting stared at by this lady over here, but that is A-OK. -okay. Um, but yeah, this is about to be the start to something new. My life is going to completely change, and I just wanted to get this on film. Um, yeah, so it's going to be a little... Uh, it's going to be an interesting couple days, couple weeks, couple months. My life has been completely different since college... And um, I've been at Lowe's this entire time, so I'm excited to bring you guys along the journey. And um, yeah, so uh, let's go hand in our two weeks and knock out tonight's work. And I will catch up with you guys after my shift. So I'll see you soon. There it is. You guys saw it. That was me when I uh, put my two weeks in. So, um, yeah, like I said, this is a new journey for me, and um, it's going to be wild. I'm so, 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 so excited to see what my life is about to turn into. I mean, this is the amount of hours and days and all-nighters and 16-plus hour days and waking up at 4 o'clock in the morning to code for three hours, to go to the gym, to go to work, to come home, to code till 2 o'clock in the morning, to get up at 5 o'clock in the morning, Sleep for two hours, rinse and repeat, 16, 17, 18 hours a day. It was a lot, but you know what they say, the only way you'll get whatever you want in life is if you don't give up. And granted, I took some breaks at times, but I, you know, I never give, gave up. I stuck to it. And um, like I said, we made it. So um, this video is basically... Hopefully my comeback, I really want to get back on YouTube and I'm going to have a lot more time. And on um, this channel, I really, really want to focus on um, just my life and how fitness and coding have completely transformed my life. I want to take you guys through day in the life of what I do, you know, what my weekends are like, when I have free time, what I do to relax, etc, etc. So um, this video might not be the best video, but this is... The first video back and i think there's no better way to get back than just recording i'm not going to sit there and do all this cinematic crap because i don't even know how but i just wanted to whip out the camera get some recording done and um put this up for you guys but yes the lowest career has ended and a new chapter in my life is beginning and honestly it feels like my life has just started so we have a lot a lot a lot of work to still cover and um this is the start to something new Thank you for watching the video, guys. Um, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you have not already. And I have lots of cool things hopefully coming in the near future for you guys. Until then, enjoy. Peace out.